don't know how I managed it, but I certainly feel like I looked the fool when I forgot the linchpin of faith casting. So let me rectify that immediately. Because how am I having faith spells and not slapping in... What does it even look like? This is the problem when I haven't used faith spells. Here it is. Golden Vow. Seriously. 15% attack up. 10% attack uh, defense up. Just like... Why, why would I not run this? Why have I forgotten this? Anyway, that and then I want to put... Uh, flame Protect Me. So that way any fire that comes my way may be less painful. Uh, and at the moment, just my own fickleness, I suppose. I want to go back to running Katana. Sorry, Great Katana. Because this thing is cool. And now I can run it with, you know, faith. Anyway, yes. Anything going to drop down on me, or... We're just going to have fun here. I'm sorry, I heard something. Hello? Yes, uh, you, sir. Who? Oh, you flash stepped over here like a crazy guy. Excuse me, I did not realize your game. Wow. Wow, okay. I'm sorry. Dude, you just keep going! You see that guy menacingly stomp his way swinging his blade across the entire hallway? Dude would not stop! Like... What, what do? Calm down, maybe? Give me a turn? I don't know why I hit that. Sit back down. Alright, undo. I mean, I was gonna try this. Yeah, dude spawned in when I got near the door. There he is. Okay. Oh my god. So that roll was buffered, by the way. I hit it in the hopes that I would recover before the next hit. I did not. And when I recovered for the delay, I got roll caught. I actually was not mashing roll. And I got punished for it. But yeah, ow. Also, don't use heavies on this guy because... I say animation lock for far too long. He also doesn't care. There we go. Got you that time. Maybe I should use Golden Vow just walking around. Okay, but who's in here? Hello. I'll be taking this. Torn diary page. That sounds like lore. A discarded page ripped from a diary bearing a passage written in tremen tremulous hand. I touched him, but only once. When he thrust his staff in my face, I brushed it aside. It was then that I touched him. The aging untouchable. Oh, we talking about the Winter Lanterns? Yeah. Yeah. Uh, oh, wait. I touched him, but only once. When he thrust his staff in my face, I brushed it aside. Do I have to parry their grab? That doesn't look... It looks like, it's a grab. It doesn't look parryable. But I think that's what it's saying. Also, I didn't have a parry equipped at the time, so... Try up. Oh, look, up. Look at that. 
I mean, it's not dung, it's a grape, but yeah. However, props to you. That was a good message. Is it just further down the hall? I can look at all the dead splotches of all the people getting stomped by one dude who decides to show up. What, the guy who appears here? Is that, are you talking to him? Don't you dare. Well, this looks fun. What do you mean, blood loss? They're shooting flame. I missed. He missed. We all suck. Oh, they're launching stuff at me. Like they're throwing. Do you have to? How do I lock onto a guy behind the wall? And how do you not have a backstab? Like, there's no way I can't not backstab you, right? Oh! Didn't land. The fact that bro flash steps over here. Just get the heal. There we go. Like, you can see him flash stepping. Secret ahead. Therefore, try research. Are you telling me there's a... A switch I have to pull? Huh. Oh. God damn, you're the guy who I locked on through the wall somehow. You also did a whole bunch of damage to me. Oh, you know what? I didn't realize where that was coming from. You are correct. I was facing the wrong way when I read that, and I got gut. That said, uh, is there anything else I can find in here while I'm being lobbed at? Aha, there is an item. Bones. That wasn't worth going back in. They're throwing, like, frenzy flame grenades at me? Also, I do not have enough to use Golden Vow again, because I spent... I mean, I could just, you know, heal up. But is it worth it? Oh, he's the lever. Is there anything else in here? I mean, I didn't see another way, so this must be just the way forward. Yep, there we go. It moved aside. Actually, it moved this way? I don't know. I didn't memorize the area. Aha, let's get to those guys who are throwing stuff. But no sneak attacks. Oh, hi. Thank you. All right, well, don't fall off. Just a rune. But you know, money's money. I'm not gonna complain. Hey there. Oh, that running heavy is a nice big sweep. I like that a lot. Did I hear someone else? Oh, there were three of you. How did I not see the rest? I guess they do kind of camouflage. Anyway, what say you? I beg you, stop. Haven't I taken enough? We're not brethren common in our line. And yet, you offer only cruelty. I ask, what crime did great Midra commit? I don't know, this is Midra's mans, though. So, I don't know. What did Midra? Little eager, dude. Little early. Time for revenge, yeah. Seems so. Ow. 
So that just keeps going, huh? You know, I guess it really isn't targeted. It is the Flame of Frenzy. Why Why would you go onto the chandelier? What point is that? Surging friendly, sur Surging Frenzied Flame. Spirit Grave Stone burned by Frenzied Flame. Uses FP to place a stone on the ground where it spews Frenzied Flames. Spirits are eternal, and yet Frenzied Flame melts them away regardless. No wonder the horn scent forbid the flame's use. And that's why Torrent is afraid. Because Frenzied Flame can burn him. Uh, I didn't get the cutscene because uh, Melina was already dead when I did the uh, Frenzied Flame ending for my playthrough. Because, uh, you know, I was just safe stating. But um, if Melina is alive... Then after the Frenzied Flame ending, you get a special cutscene with Melina, her other eye open, and her picking up Torrent's ring as it burns away. Because, you know, Torrent dies there too. So yeah, considering this is a Frenzied Flame zone, it makes sense that Torrent would be uh, less than stellar about showing up here. And I guess, like, it's not that he's afraid of dying per se, because, you know, he dies all the time when he gets hit by anything. But it's more the permadeath, I'd assume. Because even spirits burn away. All for healing. No. Just get good. Grace ahead. Are you sure? Oh, actually not lying. It's right there. Some good old rafter climbing. I'm going to get to that grace first before I deal with anything through the doorways. Because that looks... Dangerous to not have a checkpoint. So. Oh! I saw you in the trailers. You had the big spike run through your head, and then. I don't know what came of you. I am going to guess you're the Midra of this man's, and that is the, uh, the boss room of this dungeon. Because, you know, you're very unique. I can't really see the details from here, but you are definitely something. Also, is this the entrance? So, question, uh, from software. Why did you not just put a droppable ladder here? Instead of putting a grace here, why did you just not do the patented from, so from software shortcut? I can't even say it. Because, like, I can literally see it from here. Just let me drop a ladder down. I mean, I don't know how much sense that would make in terms of organicness of design. But in terms of, like, I don't know, even of quality of life, just, I feel like it'd make more sense to have a, a ladder there instead of just having another grace immediately next to it on the map, which gets really confusing. Oh, dude spawning down there. I see rats. I don't want to see rats. Rats are annoying. You can't reach me. You came really close. Kinda scared me. How did that hit me through my thrust? Oh, there are others. You know what? Never mind. I was going to try and lightning strike for the AoE, but uh, they came too close too fast. Stop it. Oh, that thrust. If I'm not locked on, that thrust doesn't work. That thrust is really good otherwise, but I have to be locked on. I mean, this might also work. 
I don't know if you'd resist fire. You're still a rat. You do not resist anything. You are burning. I like that fully charge it does a minor dot. I couldn't roll out of that, and I swung and was locked in. Jumping required ahead. Not here. Oh, this lets me fall back down, huh? Yeah, not here indeed. I've definitely been down there. Yeah, because this is just the same room. Did people get ambushed by the rats and not, like, take care of them? I guess that's it. It's just a really dark room. I don't know, I sort of just, you know, expected more. Unless there's something more and I totally missed it. That happens sometimes. Oftentimes. Too many times. Knock over those books, sit down again, and then those books will be set back up, so I didn't do anything. Yep. Anyway, next part of the zone. Oh, no. Stop it. No Inquisitors. You guys are Inquisitors, right? Because Jory was the Elder Inquisitor. I assume you guys are... There's the regular ones. You summoned a whole bunch of ghost yous. Do note, though, due to that encounter, I automatically hate you. So I hope you can live with that. Because I know you're going to die with that. Oh boy, that was cutting it close. I should have sprinted. The golden horn. Yep. Okay, I made that one. Wait, is this not a thing? Oh, I have to move this bookcase, don't I? This bookcase either moves over or slides to the side so that way I can get across. Oh, even the big ones are here. Good. They're going to teleport and jump on my head? Who can I see here? Just you? Turn it around. Huh. Where'd the other one go? I know you're here. I saw you. What? No, I know there's another one. Oh, there you are. No. Aha. So apparently, I, uh, I later learned you can backstab Jory, which made would have made that significantly easier. Oh, is this the... Wait. This... That makes the grace upstairs even dumber. Because cause they did put a shortcut here. Why is that grace up there? They, they put a shortcut here. Why is there a grace up there? That doesn't need to be there. Oh, look, a shortcut ladder. Wait, did I miss that? No, there's no way. I was gonna say, wouldn't it be funny if this was another hidden uh, doorway? It was. It was. Uh. I, I didn't even get the chance to make the joke before I swung because I'd think my sword would just, you know, clink off. It did not. It did not clink off, and now I have a new area. I didn't even finish exploring the area I had just reached. Oh, is this the switch for the part over there? Do it. Yes! Ah, oh, perfect. I can't believe that worked out the way it did. And I should be able to make that jump. Oh, and you managed to make it out of the door. Congratulations. Oh, there's two of you there. How did I not... Oh, because I... No, I didn't sit down, did I? Well, either way. Uh... I did it. It worked. I did not find out how to get... to this ladder here. And it's not this one, is it? Like, I didn't miss it up here. 
Where did these guys disappear? So I couldn't actually find a corpse. No, I think this is too high up, right? Also, there's no ladder here. So I don't know where that part is. But either way, let's head back down, clear out some... Can I help you? You know what? Fine. I'll just go around. If you're going to be camping me, I'm going to deny you. That was a good one. It's also a good one. Uh, Actually, I don't think I can get over there. There's no ladder, huh? So I have to go this way anyway. Okay, let me get my running start here. I don't know if I need it, but let's just make sure, yeah? Oh, is that someone there? Or is that a dead body? Be wary of down. Yeah, I see them. Ah, in other words, there's a drop. You know what? Thanks for the heads up. I almost didn't see it. Now that I know... this off her head no nanaya's torch actually it's probably pronounced nanaya but it's t probably not the same guy from blaze blue or tsukihime but a torch made by attaching a dying flame of frenzy to a small spinal column oh in a distant land in an age long past was born a man who failed to become the lord of frenzied flame all that remains of him is cradled gently by Nanaya. Feeble Lord's friendly- Oh, he's a feeble Lord, Frenzy Flame. Hold torch out in front and spit out Frenzied Flame. Afflicts those caught in its area effect with madness along with the user themselves. The skill will continue for as long as the button is held down can be used while moving. Okay. So I basically have Frenzy Flame stick as a torch. Also, I don't know if it's a small flame of Frenzy attached to a spinal column. I think it's... Well, your head is there. But yeah, when you become a frenzied, uh, Lord of Frenzied Flame, your head explodes into a ball of frenzy flame. And that's attached to the spine, I suppose. Uh, I need to not play with you. I need to burn you. You can't do anything. Burn away. You probably can't do anything either. That's not gonna be enough. That will. Do I just drop down from here? Is there no ladder? Probably a safe enough drop, yeah? Anything here I should be aware of? Any paintings that I can break through? Uh, I don't know if that's actually a thing up there. Oh no, those are boarded up windows. Ooh, what'd you drop? Oh, you dropped a revered spirit ash. Wild. Trio ahead. Now I'm wishing I used uh, Frenzied Burst so I can snipe him. It's clearly that range is not enough. Or at least barely not enough. Did you not notice? Well, I noticed that. Now where's number three? You also right behind here? There we go. Like, I was warned of a trio. Wicked sort. The ill omened creature. Wait, another Grace? Oh, is that the boss one right there? 
All right, let me go the other way then. How are there three graces in this tiny mansion? This mansion really isn't that big. There's like two bonfires in An Orlando. Three. I forgot about the one underneath uh, leading to Dark Moon. But there's three in An Orlando. This place is not nearly as big as An Orlando. Oh, this is just the way up. Oh, now that the bookcase has moved. Yeah, no, in order to get there, you have to move the bookcase, like, entirely. Because either you jump across, or you just go up the stairs. The bookcase is necessary. Now, this one grape. Did I even read this? What are these for? They're for crafting. They're exceedingly rare. Yes. Eyeball of a frenzy flame that has swollen from within. Not, still not actually a grape. But we're calling it that. We know it's an eyeball and we're calling it a grape. Granted, we could always call them grapes because we always knew that. Or we can always call them eyeballs. We knew that. The only one who didn't know that was, uh, what's her name? All right, well, I guess I'll slip down. Oh, wait, no, no, that becomes even dumber then. Because look. Grab this. It's another revered spirit ash. Uh, I guess I'll just fall. Yeah, no, that becomes extra hyper dumber because the grace is right here. What? Like, I see the ladder and I can kick it down, but then I go up the ladder and there's a grace right here. It's literally one room away. You don't. You don't need this grace, you just need to put a stake of America out here. You put a stake here, and then if you really need the grace... Sorry, I know I'm complaining a lot, but like, this is kind of egregious, because look at this map. This is, I also can't zoom in further. They are forced to overlap, that is how close they are. Because it's literally here, up there, and right here. They are all in the same, like, 20 foot vicinity. Even worse, they could have just put the ladder here. Like, if you really need the grace to, like, ash of war change or anything, you can just put a ladder here. Because I can warp down to that, use the grace, come back up, and have a stake of America right here so I don't have to make the climb up. Even then, the stake of America would be egregious, but I can see that being, like, quality of life. But, like... I can see these graces from each other. That's dumb. And they all lead to one another. There's a ladder in that room that leads up here. There's a ladder past that room that leads up there. They're all within quite literal spitting distance of each other, provided the walls aren't in the way. That's dumb. I guess this is a madhouse though. So, sanity wasn't in the equation. All right. Hi, sir. Do I buff before you? I'll do at least Golden Vow. Hello. The depths of your foolishness! So, like, there's gonna be a deal after this, right? Ow, he hit me. Because this can't be it. Look how pathetic he is. Ow. I say that and he's hitting me. Well, that's the fog wall. Hey, my golden vow's gonna run out. Could you work faster? Thanks. That thing is embedded. You got hit by gay bulk, dude. The spear plunged into you and branched out. You are pierced through. I have endured more. I'm gonna pull it out now. How does that work? Oh, that's how. I'm just gonna go right through. Got it. I ask you forgive me, dearest Nanaya. There it is. Pronounced Nanaya. The emphasis on the first. That is speared through even more than I thought. 
It's become your ribs, dude. It's gone through him and become a new rib cage. So how you doing? Did you lose even more of your rags? Did you get bigger? There it is. Hey, you know, I was once a frenzied flame uh, lord candidate. Oh, that's really cool for like no reason. Oh, and he has the other spike embedded in his hand. Look at this guy. He's like an evil gold mask. He's doing the pose. And he's got flame face. All right. Excuse me. Interesting spin. Oh, that was a double swipe. And explosions after. Gotta roll that to the side. Oh! And it explodes. That makes sense. I tried to roll to the side at that, that time, but it didn't come out. <laughs> Alright. You, like, don't really have a musical presence, which... I don't know if it'll hype up when you make it to phase two. But I'm not noticing much. Uh, definitely going to need Flame Protect Me. Do I have to start on your crawling phase, or are you just going to be Flame Man from the get-go? Buffs, look, I'm a Faith user. Oh, I do have to start from this. don't really resist that, do you? Oh, 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 I've made a mistake. You know what's crazy? This little dude doesn't stagger. Like, look at him hobbling around. And yet I'm scared because he has so much poise. Like, oh, that does stop him. Never mind. What am I scared of? I'm dumb. Yes, I know, I've seen it. Ah, I dodged Chorley. Okay, never mind. I didn't get the chance to heal. <laughs> I was looking for it, and I dodged the wrong ways. I need to dodge to the side, not not back. Back doesn't work for him. I need to dodge to the sides. Because dude's attacks are all in straight lines. I'm actually not going to run Ritual Shield, because that's going to happen. What I am going to run, though, is... Where is it? You, keep my buffs going, just because I don't want to worry about them. And I don't think I'm going to use spells otherwise. Because guy's a bit... Have to pin down. I could probably wait a bit on the buffing, all things considered. Depths of your... Okay, if I miss, it sucks. <laughs> Did you just howl at me? He used Hall of Shabriri. Okay, don't go for the double. One, two, three. Yep. I read it. I tried to roll, but I couldn't. Don't 
Don't go for the double. It doesn't work. All right. Oh, stabbing me. Okay, I'm alive. Barely. He didn't do the third one. Oh, what are you doing? Oh, that did a lot of damage. Laser. Nice, got the bleed. Oh, oh, that's my head. Oh, that's my spine. Oh, how am I not dead? All right, that's a grab. I don't know why I didn't heal. I hit the wrong button somehow. I think I tried to call Torrent. I, I think I, I used up all my heals during that? That's crazy. Still, this guy's a different fight compared to everything I fought in the DLC so far. This guy's classic feeling. You know, this, this guy doesn't feel as oppressive. I can read his moves. Like, by intuition which is kind of crazy also I ran out of time for this so let me try to burst him down here the depths of your shut up how Now, bring it on. I forget what my two tiers are. Oh, okay. Fall down. I've been using heavies on you. There we go. Get out, get out, get out. Oh, wow. That explosion is huge. Beam! Probably necessary. Great. Oh. Beam is painful. Heal quick. He tracked that all the way. I'm still alive somehow. I'm super not going to be alive in a minute, though. Yep. That was a double swipe. Alright. I can get you down to like half though, and I have enough FP for sovereignty. After I knock you down. Gotta get those knockdowns though. Also, what do I have in my flask? I legitimately don't even remember. 
Uh, why did you use it? Why? Why? I wanted to check it. That's not how you check it. I could have checked right there. Uh, flame. I'm not using flame right now. No one is not helping. And winged for better dodges. Let me actually magic for my sword and boost resistance and heal status. Let's go with spect hard tier so I don't take frenzy as easily. All right. Depths of Bring the crystal art so I can try and keep his poise down. Basically, if I remember, I will uh, attempt to keep his poise from increase or er, filling back up with darts. Ah, that one's harder to dodge. Don't know why I didn't dodge that. Oh, he was not going to let me go. That's a shame, because I had great setup in the first round, and then just immediately lost it. I didn't even get a chance to heal. Is it because I don't have the Windy Crystal anymore? Is that it? I hope that's not the, the change there, because that was giving me light roll speeds. Don't know why I accidentally hit that. Poke. All right, this time, don't get caught by everything. Get those charged heavies in. Yeah. Stamina back. That was not worth it. It was not worth the trade. I mean, that wasn't as bad as it could have been. Just ate that one. Even throw an extra roll in there. Four. It was five. It's a five hit combo. He was doing threes before and that one is a five. All right, sovereignty is not the way to go there at the very least. Though it would have been really cool. Let's just not use sovereignty. Let's stick to heavies when we can and roll pokes otherwise. Because I can definitely get a hang of him, provided I get those hits. Hits that are safe. Oh, I thought the poke would get him out of it. It did not. So clearly he starts there where the flame is. I don't really see if he's burned by the fingers though. Heavy. Heavy, light, well, uncharged heavy. Oh, that one was fast. 
He didn't. Not the burst. Couldn't roll out of it. I was mashing the roll. Didn't go for three. Oh, I don't know why I hit the attack button there. I knew it was going for the third. I was getting really greedy, though, because I'm like, I think I can get the knockdown. And then I didn't even get it. Huh. Yeah, I have physical and flame resist, so... Stamina regen? Not like the extra health and stamina is going to help me too much. Right? Or rather, stamina regen may help me better than just having stamina. We'll see. I also didn't drink. Probably would have helped if I actually drank my stuff. That needs to be part of the rotation. The depths of your fool. You're a fool. You keep saying the same thing. Roar. No, roar, man. You're supposed to howl. You're doing it wrong. You're supposed to howl. You're doing it wrong. You're screwing it up. Doing it wrong. I didn't lock on, which is why the roll didn't go the way I wanted. Not the way to go. Oh my god, I was stuck in that. There's the knockdown. Waiting for it. Yep. Got out of range. Stood up into the laser. Oh, when he misses, that's still a hit. He can still do an AoE. That's a problem. Three, four, five. Oh, that buffered. Excuse me. Oh, come on. How much health from full? About half. That's not the worst, but it's not the best. Two, three. I don't know why I didn't roll that. Get out. All right. Can I get two? I can. Two, three, one. Shouldn't have charged it. And I don't know why I can't roll that last one anymore. It's so weird. It's the same three hit combo and I'm just screwing it up. All right, I need to use more of my regular pokes though because I'm trying to get the charged heavies and they're not happening. So I need to replace. I need to replace my charge heavies because those openings are no longer open. Things up. Get back to Golden Vow. Okay. My buff also runs out at that point, I think, but at that point also. All right. Try 
นครับอ oh, that still hit me. That's annoying. Okay, and again. Ow, that stab still came out faster than my rolling light. I'm dodging the wrong way. I need to be dropping left then right. Oh, my charge heavy did not come out there. There we go. Oh, that one comes out still fast. One, two, three. I knew it, and I couldn't because I panic rolled. Oh, didn't didn't dodge any of that. Didn't dodge that. Didn't dodge that. One, two. One, two, three. Oh, I rolled the wrong way. I have to roll to the other side so I can get underneath the fourth swing. So, uh, I'm guessing that's not a thrusting sword because he does slash with it. I'd like to use spells and buffs, but I actually don't know when I can use them otherwise. All right, there's that. Drink, don't jump at me. Haha, -ha, I got the poke. That was perfect. Now stop wasting my time. Oh, panicked. Didn't have stamina. That was awkward. That's not it. That one is, though. Get it. Yeah. There we go. Don't let me get up. I'll get my stamina back in a second. Heal up. Back up. Didn't really work out too well. Ah, oh, the delay. I didn't roll it. Just one. Oh. Poise through that. Aha. Get it. Yes, the bleed and the knockdown. That was risky, but I took it. Didn't have the stamina. Oh no! Oh no! I didn't dodge it because I didn't have the stamina. Yes! Oh, that was so good!
That was so good! Remembrance of the Lord of Frenzied Flame. Let me go grab my zero. Oh, that fight wasn't awful. That fight was amazing. It wasn't that we oh, it was a weak foe at first, and then it wasn't. But that fight was so good! Also, I used, what, four flasks? Yeah. Granted, there isn't a lot of time to heal, and I would have used five otherwise. But I saw how low he was. That risky carrying grandeur, or carrying a uh, sovereignty that I didn't fully charge, that was, honestly, that was a good move on my part. I wasn't taking the full thing, but I was getting that bonus damage in. It was going to be hefty. That was good. And he has such a learnable fight. Those moves are incredibly readable. It's amazing. Hey, 30. Would I have had enough to go to the next level? No, because I had 98. So that would have put me at like 23 or 230. So it wouldn't have been enough for the next level. But yeah, what an incredibly learnable fight. I'm glad he's here at the end of this because the rest of this zone is garbage. Winter Lanterns, you have to get to the mansion to learn that you can parry them. But I don't have to go through here anymore. I've I've beaten the boss. Is Actually, there's nothing past this because I can't actually get around this mansion, can I? This is just empty area, yeah? I don't actually care to figure out. Alright. That's a good boss. You're a good enemy to fight, Midra. Incredibly learnable. Very, very visible. But not a cakewalk. That was great. Let me see if I can figure out what to do here. I think the thing that may have confused me, and mind you, I was... It, it may have been actually noticeable. I was very tired last time I was playing this. So, um, it didn't occur to me. His dialogue came up to ask about the truth of the universe or whatever. That may be new dialogue and I never exhausted it. Oh, yes. This evening. Yeah, ask about the nature of the world. This is the same prompt as before, which is, I'm like, I already asked that before. But the fact that it reappeared should, should have tipped me off that, hey, listen to him again. Do you recall what I said? Yeah, see, new dialogue. America. And the fingers that guided her were unsound from the start. You did mention that. Well, the truth lies deeper still. It is their mother who is damaged and unhinged. The fingers are but unripe children. Victims in their own right. We all need a mother, do we not? A I suppose. A true mother. A true mother who will not give birth to further malady. So, I'm not really picking up what you're putting down, to be honest. You don't have anything new. May you join the glimmering stars above. Yeah, I, don't, I really don't know what you're talking about. But, good luck with that. Basically, the mother of the two fingers is dumb and needs to be better because the fingers are dumb and they're not doing their job right or something. Basically, the whole system is flawed, and that's what he thinks. Alright, now has things changed? Yep! Is this now a battle zone? It is not. Actually, you're still here. No. Be on your way. Okay. So now what? Examine. Is that just a button right there? How does he not accidentally kick that? I could never have a button underneath my chair. I would 100% kick it. Especially if it does this. Could you imagine sitting there and the whole thing shifts? Secret ahead. I wouldn't have known. Oh, and the safe zone is now gone. I'm sorry. This is just under here? Well, that explains where the last bell is and why you told me about it. That explains the map. <laughs> you know what? Haven't seen that one in a while, but considering the zone... Yeah. Yeah. Those are a lot of pickles. Okay, you're a little late to the party. Anna.
Good roll. But you have poise. You're making a decision, I see. You're deciding to block. I'm not gonna lie, I don't know how we both missed. Ooh! Oh, you're using the knight set. That's the shield of knight. I'm glad you got to use that. That went super well. Claws of Night. Claws of a bottomless black from which no light can escape. Wheeled by Anna, Sword Hand of Night. Engraved the Smith script enabling strong attack to launch all three claws at a target. Oh! The blades are only semi-corporeal and cannot be fully guarded against. I'm glad I didn't guard. And you have Scatter Shot Throw. Employ smithing arts to conjure multiple copies of the armament in both hands and throw them all at once. So this allows me to be Lady Butterfly. I can slash at people like their claws, and then I can throw them as daggers. They're not even claws, actually. If you look at them, they're just a bunch of daggers held, held, helded, held Wolverine style. All right. Also, I didn't read Midra's remembrance. Remembrance of Midra, the Lord of Frenzied Flame, hewn to the Shadow Tree. As the golden barbs inflicted eternal agony upon him, Midra held fast to Nania's entreaty. Endure. The word was a curse. Sorry, Nanaya, if I want to pronounce it correctly. Okay. Yeah, he endured for a while, and then he ripped his face off, and still kept going. So, you know, good, 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 good do for him. Let's go ring a bell. Who died here? You die fighting Anna? You had, like, dual spears. You had Mesmer's spear. Oh, you're using Vike's spear and, um... And Mesmer's spear. I recognize both of those. You tried to use, uh, Vike's Ash of War, and that went poorly for you. I'm guessing you got thrown at. 